Hello everyone, it's Dragon Platinum here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to get the maze glasses in the Maze Runner. Now, this is part of the Labyrinth event, and the first thing I want to do is you want to talk to this NPC here, and he will start off your quest that you need to do. Now, the second part is that you're going to want to be able to go into the maze. Now, these doors only open during the daytime, so you have to wait for that, and the maze is constantly randomly generated, so... You might not find this as easy as I did, but basically you're looking for this temple-like building in the maze. So once you're in here, you're going to want to press the button in the middle. And after a little bit of waiting, a door is going to open up and you're going to be able to do different obstacle courses. So these obstacle courses, once you beat them and reach the end, uh, give you more buttons to open up more doors. And that's basically the main premise of the game is that you want to keep opening the doors so that you can get to the top of the structure so that you can get your prize. So as you can see here, I'm just doing my thing, jumping around trying to get to the first button, because once you get to this button here, it will unlock the next door. So there we go, we press the first button, we're gonna hop back down, and this door will open up now, and we can use this one to get the next door open, and the next one you can use the next door as well. So basically you're just unlocking doors to keep getting farther into the dungeon, and eventually, once you've unlocked the final door, you'll get out. So I'm just going to let the video play so you guys can have an idea of what the obstacle courses look like before you go into them. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. Also for this one here, uh, I tried it once and it didn't seem to work, so if you can, try to throw this crate down on it, it might help. Last time I did it, it didn't do anything and the door didn't open, so it wouldn't let me out. Don't know why, I guess you have to throw a crate on that one, but maybe you have to do that for the rest of them as well, although I didn't put crates on the rest of them as far as I remember, so it's a bit weird. Uh, I'm not sure, you guys might want to check on that, maybe I had a bug and something happened and I was supposed to put crates on all of them, but I didn't. So that'd be my bad, and the game just kind of bugged out on me. But there we go. After we completed all the obstacle courses, we're going to head out up here onto this little mountain area. Now, we're going to follow the arrows on the ground, and these are going to lead us to get to like a part where we can jump onto the actual building, and it will help us get to the top where we can receive our treasure. So there's arrows over here. We're going to go climb a little bit. Go up here. And then we're going to have to take a big leap of faith right over here. And hopefully we don't fall off. I got lucky and I didn't. And uh, for those of you who don't know, if you use shift, you can sprint. So that's always nice. Um, but then we're going to climb up these little stairs right here. Touch the treasure chest. And boom, there you go. You got your maze glasses. So there you go, guys. That is how you get the maze glasses on the maze runner. And that is all the event tutorials for the labyrinth. If you guys need to check out the rest of them, there will be links to them on my channel. I'll be like, leaving uh, one here at the end of the video, and you guys can just check out the channel if you need more. But as always, guys, uh, if you guys like this video, feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. And as always, guys, it's Dragon Platinum signing out. Peace out, guys. Bye.